All right, let's take a look at adding flat packs to Kubuntu. And for example, we'll go to uh, the Discover Center. We'll fix that later. Uh, one of the apps I like to run is AVID Mux, and it is not available in the official repositories or is a snap. It's only available as a uh, flat pack. And we can go to flathub.org and we can see everything they've got. And it comes up right there. There it is. I like it pretty good. It does a good job. And I use it pretty often, so I want to get it installed. So let's do the first thing. This is. Uh, how to install Flatpak support in Kubuntu from Flathub uh, on 18 and above. We just do this on older Kubuntu with older Kubuntu versions. We want to do this, so let's let's highlight this and just follow the program, just like Flatpak is prescribed. We hit enter yes. There we go. So far so good. So um, I'm running the latest version of uh, Kubuntu. So you probably will be too. So just pay attention to newer older. This is one we're doing for a newer release. This is for older install the discover flat pack back end and this is going to let you use the discover center to see flat packs all right so 18.04 newer run this on 2004 and later run this and this is this is the one that we want we have a later version than 2004. Let's do this. Alright, so the first thing we do, we install flat packs. Now we install flat pack support for the Discover Center. And we need to install the flat pack. Flat Hub repository. So let's do this. And it's there. So you're probably all excited you got Flat Pack installed and you want to go uh, find a program. If you let's try it again, let's close it out. Let's just start from scratch. If you go here, it shouldn't be found. I did. Typically, what you need to do is a reboot because it even tells you right here to do a restart. If something's not coming up, do a restart. Here we are, we're installing the flat pack. A little easier than I thought it was going to be. Your mileage may vary, but there it is. We'll let this install and we'll take a look at uh, a package that I know is available in multiple different uh, sources. And that's a G edit. We'll just wait for this to install and we can switch over. I don't want to interrupt it. Well, we could we could just go ahead and do it. Let's go G-Edit. Let's load the information. We go to G-Edit. And we have sources. We click it. And we have FlatHub support that we just added. The official release. And then the snap. And it's up to you. I'm not going to make any recommendations. That's, that's for you as a personal preference. But that's just an example of 
uh, how you can look at your sources and you can pick from the source that you want to install from. Let's go back to AVI Demux. Let's just click on it. And it doesn't have any other options because Flatpak is the only place it can get it from. And that's it. So if you're trying to get Flatpak on your Kubuntu, just do like that.